Hi there. Yeah, it's me. I'm playing with my Logitech webcam some more. I thought I'd have some fun. This one is called The Silent Birds. And, uh, <clears throat> excuse me, it's from February 21st. I had uh, quite a run of journals that day. And this is the first one. So, here we go. The rain pours from the heavy, pregnant sky, falling gently down, straight down. Now the wind picks up for a moment, and I hear a sort of roar. Beautiful, beautiful harbinger of spring, raining down its life-giving, life-awakening blessings. I am grateful. I like to step outside each morning with my cup of coffee and my cat, Priscilla, to take in the fresh air, salute the sun, and place my feet on the earth directly. It is a blessing. Sometimes I can even feel it, as if receiving an energy adjustment in the body. I haven't been doing this for a long time, though. Deep into my hermit days, I hardly stepped out of the house at all, making a run for groceries only, or doctor's appointments, perhaps once or twice each month, I kid you not, I was pretty, excuse me, pretty housebound. Things have been improving so much and so fast, though, that it is like I am a spring flower, blossoming under the universe's tender care. So, each day, I take in the fresh woodland air and reconnect with Gaia. Here's the thing, though. It was not yet raining when I stepped out this morning. The odd thing is that the birds were silent. None of them were singing, as they usually are. We often whistled back and forth to each other, but no response was there today. So, I sung to them. I love to sing anyway, though I usually just do it for source, as an expression of heart's love overflowing. I also sing for the birds sometimes. It's kind of funny, really. I can't whistle worth a flip. <laughs> Oh, I can make a sound, but it is not impressive. Then they sing with their beautiful sounds and chorus, each one so different, some loud, some so soft. Then there's me with this pathetic little one or two note whistle. I think it was one morning when I was simply too joyful to hold it in that I just broke out in song for them. I wanted to show them that humans can sing too. Oh, they listened, too. They listened. Since then, sometimes I'll sing to them. So, this morning, they got a song. Hoping I was priming their pump, I sang another one. Still, just silence. Only one little, uh, only one, little one piped up once. Otherwise, nothing. Not being a hiker or camper or outside person much, I don't know why they were silent. Maybe they do that before it rains. Maybe there were predators in the area. Though what the, those could be, I don't know. Just other birds, I guess. But I saw no hawks or eagles, nor even crows. I think the only danger of crows is to the eggs or the chicks, and it's too early for that. But anyway, I guess it'll have to remain a mystery. I live in the woods on a hill in rural northwest Arkansas, by the way. Birds aplenty we have, and at all times. We are blessed. What a strange journal this has been. Oh well, sending out love. Bye!